Hello everyone, my name is John. Today I will tell you how to set up integration to transfer new rows from Smartsheet to Key CRM. This is necessary to automatically transfer new rows from Smartsheet to other systems. For example, through Key CRM you can create new orders and conveniently interact with them in the future. Now let's move on to the setup. First you need to create a new connection. Next, select the data source system, Smartsheet. Now select the action, Get Rows, New. At this point you need to connect your Smartsheet account to Apex Drive. In this window you must specify the username and password for your Smartsheet account. At this point, you must grant Apex Drive access to use your Smartsheet account. When the connected login appears in the list of active accounts, select it and click Continue. Next you need to select the sheet from which you will receive new rows. At this stage, you can set up a data filter, in this case there is no need for this, so just click Continue. At this stage, you see an example of data for one of your Smartsheet rows, if you are satisfied with everything, click Continue. At this point, setting up the Smartsheet data source has been successfully completed, now you need to move on to setting up the data destination. We choose a system, Key CRM. Then select the action, Create Order. At this stage you need to connect your Key CRM account to the Apex Drive system. In this window you need to specify the API key, to get it, go to your Key CRM personal account. Then go to Settings, General. Copy the API key and paste it into the appropriate field in the Apex Drive system. When the required field is filled in, click Continue. When the connected account appears in the list of active accounts, select it and click Continue. At this stage you see key CRM fields for creating new orders. You can assign variables from Smartsheet to these fields to do this. Click in the field and select a variable from the drop-down list. Please note that you can use not only variables, but also enter values manually. When all the required fields are assigned, click Continue. At this point, you see an example of the data that will be sent to Key CRM in the form of new orders with each new row from Smartsheet. If you are not satisfied with something, click Edit and you will go back a step. In order to check the correctness of the settings, click Send Test Data to Key CRM. After successful submission, go to Key CRM and check the result. If you are satisfied with everything, return to the Apex Drive service and continue setting up. At this point, setting up Key CRM as a data destination has been successfully completed. Now you need to enable auto update and select an update interval, for example, once every 5 minutes. That's all. I wish you successful integration settings and good luck.